standing by a post he made on social media about Australia Day. It's a day of mixed emotions, pride for many, but pain for First Nations people. It is a difficult and complex day and what is really heartening is that more and more Australians are coming to understand the truth of the Australian story. And for some, comments like this are doing nothing to help. Queensland MP Andrew Lamming made the post last week. It's been slammed as racist and abhorrent. The comments are unacceptable. Uh, they're ignorant. It does not help to inflame uh, what is all, already a very difficult time. His views are racist stereotypes that poison our public debate. Mr Laming should acknowledge the hurt and harm that his words have caused and apologise. But Mr Laming is unapologetic, instead doubling down. Are we a serious nation about closing gaps or do we just dabble at the margins and argue over Australia Day? Labor wants the Prime Minister to call it out. You can't on the one hand, as the Prime Minister say, uh, the standard you walk past is the standard you uh, accept without taking some action. The Minister for Indigenous Australians, Ken Wyatt, declined to comment to SBS World News. Last week it was Scott Morrison who drew criticism for his comments about Australia Day that were labelled divisive and selfish. It's all about acknowledging how far we've come. You know, when those 12 ships turned up in Sydney, all those years ago. It wasn't a particularly flash day for the people on, on, on those vessels either. Mr Morrison later defended the comment saying he wasn't comparing the experience of Indigenous people and European settlers. Pablo Vinales, SBS World.